Mr. Unwin, um, could you tell me how a type B differs from that of perhaps a type A? Ah, yes. Well, uh, as you know, A is numerical horde would perceive of this. Now, uh, you have first of all a hybrid with 600 hold, which is the first input in a matchy half for the secondary. So really, it preceded that and it's part exchange most on account of the cost of production. So really, we've got to work down to a very low cost on that. And the soup, we'll have the B, have you heard of the B index minus follow room? Oh, yes, of course. Yes. Well, that's going to be a much cheaper job and really do a fine job, I assure you. Oh, yes. Well, how, how, you say it'll do a fine job, mm -hmm. um, but uh, the, the present Type B equipment, I mean, mm -hmm. how, how would you say that, is that, is it a good piece of equipment, do you think? Oh, it is, excellent, but the thing is, through time, uh, production of new raw materials, a lightweight emotion, or a transformer for, for the core weighty, you know what I mean? Yes. yes. Uh, also, a size emotion, or a carry porter bowl, mm. so that you can have it, you can stuff it in the rack for the solidity, solid fixy of a static thing, or make it a part of the most for walking out into the field to do a stuff, a, job like that. Yeah. Uh, so really, uh, integration is coming to a very fine hoardy, that's the main thing. And of course the government wire papers the economic uh, acts which has suffered on the account of television, so we've got to do that. Of course. Yes. Um, I'm on the type B now, I've heard of something called clean feed. Perhaps you could, you could explain that. Oh yes, well of course I had a lot of experience of this at 1854, which is the first chance of four radios in Pensy, and since then on royal tours. And it was found that um, a clean feed is a back grove oral further scale, as it were, to cover up anything was in actuality most and make it sound of the smooth continued. You see, it's got to be done that way, and really that's what a clean feed has got to be marked too, so the note you plug it in jacks the right hole. Yes. yes. Oh yes. Because on a Type B, you've got, um, the same as a Type A, you've got, you have got an echo, haven't you? You can... Oh yes, echoes. oh you can do that. Well, earlier on, with the capping at Eckersley, the source of patent through fire fur on echoes, uh, it did show that uh, uh, we prefer to get a natural fur. That is, if you've got a long tube, uh, which you follow through on the other end, it can be done electrically. And that was thought to be cheaty, but now we find that the cheaty is so near to the realistic fur for it that we can do that and get away with it. Yes. Oh yes. The, what what uh, um, is, is the gain of the main amplifier? Uh, through T4, which is DB most in the type of valve with this mu that we have, yeah. and it's been developed through, uh, if the DB's gain, which is 20 log over through, as you know, it's fine divided by, mm. gives you that right answer, uh, and you can choose a valve to suit that. You see, mind you, you've got to do a matchy most in it. Yes. yes. May I ask you a quest hold? Yes, of course. Well, in the case of a cathode folly, which is a follower through fault on that for matching an impedance, yes. uh, um, what do you feel yourself as an experimented 4D? Uh, I would say that <clears throat> Perhaps if you plug the clean feed to Uganda type um, administration, you might mm. get this Afghanistan. Mm. Uh, well, you know what I mean. Mm, very good, too. very good. Mm. Oh, yes. Yes, I, I, that's the sort of answer I would have expected. And I do a great congratulating most when you'd pass it number through if I was taking an examination of pay, pay. Oh, yes, I would you do would. that. Mm. Oh, good. Thank you very well much. Well done. Well, perhaps I can carry on now. Um, yes, please. Ask yes. you the question. I'm sorry to shoot it in the bloom. Oh, of course, yes. Mm. Mm. Uh, well, mm. this, uh, what was I about to say there? You, you've confused me with all these facts. No. Um, the <clears throat> Type B, um, as opposed to the, the Type A, uh -huh. and Marconi, it's, it was developed when? Uh, well, at the time the Coherence first developed in Chelmsfold and Rittle, you know, uh -huh. on that. Uh, but uh, I think it was the early turn of the century was the first world came through and finished to a perfection in 18, 1931. Yes, and you've got a jack field on the type on the type B as well, haven't you? Oh yes, rather. You can, yes. You can cross plug. Yes, you can do a cross plug in most. Uh, got to watch the impedance all matchy again, but uh, providing you uh, don't have too many which loaded in half, as you know, it's uh, 20 log again. It'll, yes, you'll, yes. you'll better get heavy loady. Oh yes, so you mustn't do that. <coughs> oh no. And it is, is it high level mixing or? or? No, well, it's uh, it's just high level mixing in the most on account of with low level uh, it picks up the noise of the contact making the change over keel. Mm. You mentioned the changeover keel. Could you sort of mm. uh, expand on that? Well, look, if you have a Kellogg keel, which is after the two-pole change, yes. uh, and the contact resistance EPS, mm -hmm. then X squared suffers through for low impedance feed D. So you've got to shoot it in four for the high impedance feed if the contact receptor is low in relation to it, and so it won't make much interference. I see. Well, thank you very much, Mr. Unwin. Well, code. Oh. <laughs>